this is Jamie Oliver from the Oliver's Madhouse and from jamieoliver.com. Um, I'm now on week four with Jane Plan and although I've been running a little bit behind, I really wanted to update you all on um, on what it's been like for the, for the entire month, really. Um, first and foremost, um, another loss this week, although I've not been to the gym, I have been very careful to the point of painful. It is sort of the week before Christmas. Um, it, it's... Um, not an ideal time, I think, um, for watching what you eat. I've lost two pounds, which is still two pounds lost. I know I could have done better, and I know um, that exercise and being active is um, also going to be beneficial. But I work from home, I've been very busy, I've been trying to tidy up work, so in my defence, it's my own fault that I haven't lost more. So, um, Besides that, I'm really looking forward to um, the new year. I think I'm going to tackle uh, moving forward and keep going with, with Jane Plan because I felt really positive. There's only been one particular day that I felt really down um, with this kind of, of plan, but more out of my own guilt because there's the whole issue of oh, well, you're fat, so you shouldn't eat this and you shouldn't eat that. But it's 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 what's in my head and not necessarily, you know, what's going off with, with the eating programme that I've been on. I am going to pick up the pace next year. I've um, I've struggled a couple of days, um, more so than the other weeks, really. I've, I've just been diagnosed as having gallstones. So um, what I thought was um, all sorts of other randomness, actually pertains to having having bouts of um, upset gallstones so I feel better about that and it also means that um, I can look at obviously foods that I you know should include and shouldn't include going forward so that's really helpful to know it is probably the one thing on a biscuit aisle that I have to take as I walk past so the fact that your snacks have got some absolutely gorgeous ones great stuff now okay so overall um throughout the well shall we say 26 days of um Jane plan so um I've actually dropped a dress size which is great I'm also feeling like I'm I'm not being being squeezed into most of my clothing, so um, which is is great because obviously I've got the next size clothing down already, so so they're not feeling really tight that I've you know really got to shove myself in there. Overall, I'm feeling really happy. Um, it's probably the happiest I've been with with my weight loss um, to date, even though you know I lost quite a lot of of, of weight in two thousand and twelve. Be aware of what I'm eating. I think that's my biggest thing. It's really, really simple to just shove it in my face. That's great. It tastes great, but actually, I've no idea how many calories. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use my fitness pal, and I'm going to actually make an effort to log my calorie intake because I think this might be really great for me to have a wider picture of um, where my calories are coming from how easy it is to abuse them and may give me a bit more insight but um, I'm also going to look at continuing possibly with with um, Jane Plan throughout um, January. I would really like to lose as much weight as possible and I think this is going to be a really good step. I'm also going to um, get my butt into gear and get to the gym. Now I went to, obviously I missed an update um last week on video but i have been going to a ladies only gym which is in the next village from us i've absolutely loved it and i've loved it because there's just no pressure all i can say is is from you know ladies my age younger two ladies in their 80s um attend this particular gym and i like the fact that that there is no pressure so I can fit it in when suits me. I really am 
looking forward um, to getting some classes under my belt. I want to go back to um, yoga and Pilates because I think they're really great for strengthening my back and my pelvis. And I'm really looking forward to... Now, ideally, I don't know if this is ever going to happen because we'd also like another baby. Um, we don't do things by heart, obviously. Is to actually start running again and go back and play hockey now hockey season obviously is going to um sort of finish march april may time so um the likelihood is I'm not going to be running by then but who knows in september so i've missed it i've missed the camaraderie i've missed the fact that my daughter is now taking my place on the team um and I just generally want to be seen as a fit and healthy person not just for other people's perspective, but from mine too, which I think is, is a massive thing. So I've absolutely loved your help, Jane Plan. Thank you. And um, I look forward to hopefully seeing you in 2015.